Well, hello again, and welcome to uh, Hometown Hero number 95. Can you believe it? We're getting closer to that 100 number, and when we get to 100, we're gonna have a celebration. I don't know what we're gonna do, but we're gonna have a celebration, I promise you. But this morning, uh, we have a, a special guest, another Hometown Hero. Tracy Hamby is here, and Tracy, how are you this morning? I'm Good to see you. And you brought some friends with you. Who are I your do. friends? I have Krista Hollis on this side and Jane McFadden on this side. Is that your team? This is part of my team. And tell me a little bit about your camp. So we run the Camp Wolf program. We're going into our 20-something year. Wow. wow. And it was actually started by a group of families way back in the day. But it's a summer camp for kids with intellectual disabilities. So we've got campers that range in age from 6 through 23, and we offer camp. Wow. Arts and crafts and swimming and taekwondo and dances with the DJ, bounce wow. houses. Sounds like fun. Visits from the animal center, you name it, we what, do it. What are the kids like at your camp? So they range in their disability. We have campers with Down syndrome, cerebral palsy, autism. Our campers also vary in what they can and can't do. So you're going to see some folks that are more independent, but then we also have some folks that we provide support for so they can be included as well too. So where is, where is this camp? This past summer, we had two locations. We typically will use Williamson County Schools as our locations. We were at Perry Creek Elementary School and Crockett Elementary School. So we love both administrations. The principals are fabulous to work with. So Great. with their support, we make this happen. And how many kids normally come to camp? 60 campers per week per site so oh we average about 120 a week so we had over 150 this summer you must be a patient lady <laughs> they are too <laughs> they are too. well it's good to have you here this morning and uh we john gallagher who is our man general manager of this of this campus i like calling it campus uh has got a little something for you this morning thank you to, so uh, much to help out with camp We've got a check for your charity here Oh, thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. And we've got our hometown hero trophy. Yes, yes ma'am. Sure. Our director gets to see this, too, so thank you so much. <laughs> thank you so much. Well, I, I like checks and trophies, and I like being in Victory Circle, and that's what this is, because you're a winner. Thank you so much.